What's happening, YouTube family? AI the Mutt Mechanic coming back at you guys live. And I know it's been like a week before I had my last video when I showed you guys how to make 100k a day. And I really hope that tip is working out for you guys right now. But what I want to do for this particular video is I want to go over some of the new cars that just came out. Uh, no, I won't be going over the Brian Arakpo. I don't. I usually don't go over big name cards unless you guys ask me to because it's kind of self-explanatory it's a beast card regardless and i try to go over the cards that are more accessible to the you know to people like us you know the blue collar workers the guys that don't really spend that much money on the game and just want to kind of get by with a pretty good team so without further ado let's get into it and today i will be reviewing the marcel darius and the new colin kaepernick card that just came out friday so uh, let's get into it. Uh, Rising Stars. I was just checking Rising Stars and see if I can get something. Yeah, my coins are low. Uh, look at it. My coins are kind of low right now. But, you know, I'm going to get them back up. I had like um, I got like almost 20 items in the auction. I, I purchased a card this week. And uh, I was telling Chase earlier, I was telling him that I'm thinking about... Um, let's see. Who am I looking for? Is it Combat Final Edition? No quarterback. It was a it's a combine warrior card. I was thinking about trading my trading my Barry Sanders to check out the new C uh, the new um, combine monster CJ2K. And uh, Benji, if you're listening, let me know how that card works out for you. I'm thinking about picking that card up for my team. But you guys already know how I feel about. Damn, people are not playing. You know how I feel about... You guys know how I feel about CJ. Every time I'm in a clutch situation, he always tends to fumble the ball for me. So, I'm kind of hesitant on picking him up. But his strength is better. His carrying is better this time around. His speed is way up there. So, I might look at and trading my... Um, trading my running back which is Barry Sanders for that particular card and they'll give a plus two speed boost to the rest of your team so why not why not try them out right all right so let's look at it Colin Kaepernick and I think this card right here it's 98 overall short pass round and pound chemistry I think this card right here is kind of comparable to Marcus Mariota the card I had that I'm going to pick up again in, in a few I think these those cards really mirror each other. This card right here, once we get into the stats, they're about the same height. Uh, I'm gonna tell you guys which stats kind of what separates the two cards. All right, so right off the bat, strength is 68. I know Marcus Mariota is 74. Agility is 95. I think Marcus Mariota's agility is 91. Speed is 96. I think Marcus Mariota's speed is like a 94. Acceleration 96. Marcus Mariota's speed is like a 97. And here's uh, uh, here's the difference right here. His Colin Kaepernick's awareness is 85, where I think Marcus Mariota's awareness is 80. But I don't think that plays too much. I think that's more goes along placing the ball where it's supposed to be and not making bad throws versus you know making good. But I think that's more of a computer thing anyway. But this card is a beast though. Eddie Carrion, which I like that. I think uh, Marcus Mariota is like a 74, 75. Throw power though. This is the, one of the main differences between the two cards. Throw power 100 versus Mariota's throw power which is 95 throw accuracy is a 96 which is better than cams i would definitely look at upgrading this card over cam so 96 Mariota's is a 99 uh let's get to the to the to the better stash trucking and loosening both cards are really elusive ball carry vision i think marcus is like an 88 colin is a 97 it, and this card is really more if you're trying to <clears throat> run a lot with cap and and, and chunk the ball deep that's what it comes down what it comes down to spin move juke move is on point um let's go down a little bit uh injury and stamina is pretty good all right throw short is 90 i think marcus Mariota is like a 98 or something like that or a 97 throw mid is an 89 marcus is like a 94 93 throw deep is a 95 is where this card really shines marcus Mariota has a 90 but like i said this card is if you like to throw throw bombs and get out the pocket and throw dots uh play action is really good with this card for guys who like to use play action and throwing on the run throwing on the run is very good uh marcus mariota's uh play action is like a 93 his throwing on the run is like a 96. so all in all between those two cards i'm gonna still roll with mariota but i can very well see myself getting this card especially with that 
plus two awareness on this car. I think that'll really help. But I really like this card. So for me, I'll probably pick a Mariota because he's cheaper. And, you know, people are spending 150 something for this card. So do I think he's worth that much? No, I, I would say 120, 100 around that range. But it's, it's a very solid card. Uh, and plus, Mariota's chemistry rolls with mine. This one doesn't. So I'm rolling with Mariota on that one. All right. So let's go a little deeper. Let's look at the Marcel Darius. Is it Marcel Darius or Martel Darius? I don't want to butcher his name. Don't want to butcher his it's final edition. All right. There you go. So we see the cheapest is a 130, which isn't bad for this part. Let's look at the highest one. So it's right off the bat. It has zone defense and pass rush chemistries. I uh, really like that a lot. And honestly, we're going to go ahead and compare this card. I think this card is very comparable to Mean Joe Green. This is a poor man's Mean Joe Green. Uh, and then you can just look at the tail of the tape right here. Let's go deeper in the stats. Both of them have uh, pass rush. and Well, this one is zone defense pass rush. And, uh, and Mean Joe Green is pass rush run stuff. So let's look at the you know heights are very almost the same identical strength is the same agility is almost identical speed plus two go to marcel darius acceleration goes to mean joe green awareness goes to mean joe green plus five uh, i think the awareness is pretty good for like sniffing out screens and stuff like that tackling is, is, is almost the same uh darius can jump a little more let's go down to the meat and potatoes power move 99 uh Finesse move 68 compared to Mean Joe Green 76. Lock shaving the same. Pursuit the same. Play recognition almost the same. And I was I was really thinking about trading this Mean Joe Green for this Marcel Darius. The only thing that didn't stop me was um, that awareness. You know what I mean? So injury is high. Stamina is high. Uh, hit power is almost the same. Yo, they're pretty. They're kind of identical. Another thing that stopped me from trading out these cards is. Uh, mean Joe Green is uh, he's he's 100k I think 100k more but his his awareness is a little better you know and I'll take that awareness over this card the low awareness uh, he has a little bit higher speed and then his acceleration is not as good so I thought about it for a while uh, trading this card and honestly if you guys want to do the game right and you had about 200k because I don't think this card is going to drop anytime soon. 130 is about... 120, 130 is about as good as you're going to get in this card. And I give two thumbs up in supporting this card. Get this card. This card looks like a monster. I don't know who has him. If anybody that has him, in the, uh, just let us know in the comment selection below how he plays for you. But I played him um, when, when you know you do the little final edition little computer thing where you get some coins and stuff and get the final edition card i played that and he was kind of block shedding my my uh he was block shedding my guards uh pretty well so that that's a telltale sign that this is a pretty good card also if you wanted to pair this card for 100 200k i would pair him with don terry poe i would pair him with don, De don terry poe 200k uh, a little a little more 200k you got two all-star defensive tackles very hard to beat now terry poe is a beast in itself 100 strength i think i reviewed this card before if i haven't uh he's 100 strength power move 99 this card is it's crazy i promise you you know I, you know I, I bs you not this card is a is, is a monster card if the awareness and stuff wasn't as low and if i wouldn't heck purchase uh john randall i would definitely get this card very very good card definitely use those two in combination if you're low on coins and you don't have like 500 to a million coins to get the better cards i definitely say you should get those cards just my two cents um and, and do the game real proper so that's it for this video i'm ai the Mutt mechanic i will be trying to get back on my grind and start uploading videos daily i think later on today i might try to post uh some gameplay some mud gameplay i have actually a, a whole bunch of those videos i just haven't had the opportunity to sit down and render and you know give you guys the voiceover but i'm gonna start sending those out daily like i used to do i'm ai the Mutt mechanic signing out appreciate you guys for listening watching and commenting and i will catch you guys on the next video 131 and i'm out this thing peace